Hi, I'm Austin. So um, today I'm going to be talking about uh, our physics project and this name is called Meat Spin. So what is our product made up of? So let me show you what is it made up of. So our product is made up of 90% acrylic. And uh, then we use some wood and we also use a tin can. So it's simple to make. So we got this acrylic and we laser cut it from the fab lab using the laser cuts. So it's uh it's quite nicely cut, as you can see. Yep, so this is the base. You can see this is the base. Yep, uh, this is the this is the side view. <coughs> yeah, and this is the top view, you can see. So it's pretty neat though. Okay. So uh so uh this part this part is also very important because this part is the one that holds the fan and it, and it has to be and it has to be strong enough to hold the fan and to ensure that it won't break because you know if you put enough force here it may, it may cause it to break so so we decided to think of an idea to use many layers of acrylic and the one that allows our fan to spin is through a mini ball bearing inside can you see okay let me try to put it down it's a, it's a mini ball bearing inside that allows our fan to spin because if you put it, if you just chuck it in, if you just chuck it in, the 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 fat, the can will not be able to move at all because there's too much friction. So the ball bearing really helps. So hi again. So let me share with you the concept of our product. So our product mainly uses the conservation of energy. So as you know, energy cannot be created or destroyed. So in this case, the energy is, comes from the ca the candle in the form of chemical energy. So this candle will form heat energy when it's lighted up and the heat energy will be converted to kinetic energy of the fan when I put it here. Okay. So another concept we'll be applying is through the, the concept of heat transfer. So as you know there are three forms of heat transfer, uh, conduction, convection and radiation. So our product mainly uses the concept of convection. As you know like uh, this is because hot air rises, cold air sinks. So the heat the heat produced from the candles will, uh, will rise up to the fan blades causing the fan blades to rotate as you can see it's, uh, it's, it's currently rotating as I move it closer yep. so, uh, so this, uh, this heat molecules will interact with the fan blades causing it to rotate that's how it basically works Good. hi guys so let me share with you the behind the scenes action in the fab lab come with me guys Okay. Hi, good afternoon friends. This is our physics project and currently this is our first prototype. As you can see, the fan blades are made of wood. While experimenting, we realized that the heat energy from the candle was not sufficient to spin the fan blades. Oh, it seems that our project do not work at all. But we came up with another idea. We used beverage cans to make the blades. Suddenly, we see some hope. Well, the, it appears that the wind on the top surface is too strong. So our group decided to do it under the table. And wow, it really starts to rotate. Okay, let's, let's remove the candles to see whether it really affects the spinning of the blades. And see, see how it slows down. And when you put it back again, look how it speeds up. Oh yeah! It's really the power by the candle. So this is uh this is the three candles. Let's try two candles. Look, it seems a bit slower. And now let's show you one with one a candle by one side only. And look, the fan is not really moving. <laughs> 